Yes. Uh huh. I'm all by him. I gotta be. <laughs> How is it? 61 degrees. <laughs> Chile. I'm gonna laugh if that rock's so slippery you can't get up. <laughs> Put the lighter. Put the lighter. <laughs> For those of you that have been following us, you know we have been doing an incredible sailing trip all over this big, wild, amazing lake. Um, last we left off, I think we were over here somewhere, Potter Cove, and then we had to a teeny weeny little island here, explore that area, and come all the way up here to this super sweet, adorable little pick island. Yeah, thanks for watching. I will caught all the fish in Otter Cove. Every last one of them. Awesome. No more fish left. So now we're moving to Dave's. Dave's Island? Dave's Harbor. Dave's Harbor. Look at that. There's a puff. How fast we going? 5.3? Five, 5.3 three. Five three with just the jib. hunkered down behind Dave's Island. Dave's Harbor. Dave's Harbor. Sorry. We just went through that itty bitty teeny weeny little gap. I wasn't nervous at all.
Who else is St. Marie? 11. Day 11. 11 days since we've seen civilization. Milk went bad today. <laughs> Milk went bad. Ham went bad. Ham went bad. We still have eggs. Lots of Kraft mac and cheese. Yup. And ketchup. Kraft Heinz ketchup. ketchup. Lots of wieners. Don't forget about the hot dogs. Oh yeah, hot dogs. So the fridge engine pump went out, so we're back to the the inverter run AC side, which is not ideal winter project. But add it it's to a little, the list. A little scary being that we're only source of refrigeration now. <laughs> There's not much to refrigerate. But I guess that's probably still a lot more than what I have, so can't complain. We got like three quarters of a tank of gas, right? Mm. Half it. You probably see more like half a tank. And how far do we have to go? Um, about 150 miles, which like should be fine, except the next four days it's still light wind. Light wind. Home. 15 so, gusting to 45. <laughs> might be a lot of, might be a lot of motoring. But right now, this is unexpected. This is perfect. So how many more days do you think that'll be? I think we're looking at, if we take our time and stop at a couple places you want to see, probably four more days to like Rossport. Four days to Rossport. And that would be like a, a minor resupply there, some limited stuff. Still no gas there. Oh, I thought they did have gas. No, that would be Red Rock, which is like another 25 miles. So we're basically there once we get there, but okay. we're not there. I think it'll be a lot easier to manage once you get up north, because it'll be a lot more inland protected sailing if you want it, like versus here we, we're forced out of the open lake every time you want to go somewhere on the, the rocky shores of the eastern side. Oh, because you'll be able to like hunker well, it's like down. The, or... It's like the north channel up there, you know, where there's like, you're kind of always behind some sort of island or something, you know, so you can like navigate your way through there. So even on like crummy weather days, it's like much more manageable there. than like the super exposed open side of Lake Superior that we're on now. Good to know. Good to know. I'm back. <gasps> How about your favorite day? I don't know. Yesterday was pretty fun. 35 knots of wind. So then we tucked into that cove and then went on a really cool hike on that coastal trail and caught a bunch of northern in this really cool lake. Secret fishing hole. I didn't like the sailing. He didn't like the sailing. Yeah, it was sporty. It was sporty. Thunderstorms, lightning, and peak gusts of 36.7 knots. It was good. She handled it fine. I saw it. Not nine, me, the boat. Not the boat. <laughs> I saw nine and a half knots at one point. Got some pretty good, pretty good water across the bow several times. That's the fastest you've ever seen. It might be, yeah. yeah. Nine and a half knots. We were surfing, obviously. We're just pulling in to Alloway Island. A little gap in the rocks. Over there. It's supposed to be just like a picturesque anchor when we get back there. There's Pick Island. Just got sucked in by the fog. But it was a beautiful snicker sail. Are we over? Made it! I think you're close enough. <laughs> oh, Jet would be so disappointed in this anchor. <laughs> Bowsprit. 
It's the entrance. Homemade bread, eggs. Pretty stuff about the homemade bread. Only took an entire week. Now I'll go fast. I expected everything. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Except we're out of flour. Hand grind the wheat. Y'all heard that, folks. Hand grinding the wheat. Glad to see you found a shirt to go under that vest. That's for Molly. Weatherman said it's beautiful out. They did not. <laughs> Just slight chance of precipitation. I think he actually said 98% humidity. It's crazy.